everybody, my name's Lauren Key, I'm a SharePoint engineer and today I'm going to be teaching you how to create multilingual communications pages on SharePoint Online. In other words, creating pages so that your content can be displayed in different languages. Now not only is this a really new feature that has been launched in SharePoint Online, it's extremely, extremely relevant to our current situation that has seen so many organisations embracing remote working. So let me show you how to do it. So first of all we go to the COG, Site Information, View All Site Settings, Now under Site Administration, you're going to click Language Settings. You're going to turn on to enable pages and news to be translated in multiple languages. Now you'll see that English is uh, applied by default and I've added in the Spanish language there. We're going to add in another language. You can either type or select your language from the drop-down list. We now need to set our translator. So we type in who we want to translate the page, scroll down, save, go back to our landing page, Choose the page that we want to be translated. Here is mine, as you can see, it's currently in English. So we go to translation. You can click to create for all remaining languages, or you can select individual languages that you wish the page to be translated into. The translator will then get an email notifying them that the page is ready to be translated. And once they've finished translating, you will get an email back to say the page has been ready. Once that has happened, you go to the arrow, you select the language you want to read it in, and there we have it. The page that we've created is now in Spanish. The translator can translate the page title, the site description, the navigation and the footer content into the preferred language so that users can view the content in their preferred language. So there you have it. You have learned how to create multilingual communication pages in SharePoint Online. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video on Monday.